Hello everyone, hope you're doing good. Well, if you're getting this error, your DNS server might be unavailable or if your DNS server is not responding, I have a very quick fix for you. For this, you just need to click on the search icon and type CMD. And the moment you will find the best match command prompt, you just need to click on run as administrator. And you need to click on yes and a new window will appear like this so if you click on run as administrator you will find C Windows system 32 if you just open it you will find C users something like that and that will not work so here we need to type a command IP config slash space or slash plus DNS since it's a DNS issue, then we need to flush it and I'll let you know what needs to be done. So here you have typed IP config space forward slash plus DNS and then hit enter. The moment you have done that, we have successfully flushed the DNS from our computer and now we need to set the DNS. So here in the search icon, you need to type ncpa.cpl and you will find control panel item, the best match, ncpa. So you just need to click on that and a window will appear like this. Now this will work on Windows 10 and Windows 11 both. So let me show you. So here we need to select our uh, adapter. If you're using Wi-Fi, you can select Wi-Fi. If you're using Ethernet, you can select Ethernet. So I'll select the Wi-Fi and I'll click on, I'll just do a right click. I'll go to properties. And here we need to go to this internet protocol version four. And then go to properties. And here you need to enter the DNS 1.1.1.1, then 1.0.0.1. This is a Cloudflare DNS, which is a very great DNS. You can also use Google DNS 8.8.8.8 and 8.8.4.4. So I'm using the Cloudflare DNS. You can also try that and see if big difference in browsing. Uh, there will be a faster browsing experience. You just need to uh, click on OK and you just need to restart the computer. That's a must. And once you are done with the restart, come back and see the difference uh, and let me know how's the performance and if that issue of the DNS server is fixed or not. So if DNS server is not responding or DNS server is unavailable, I'm sure it has been fixed. Please do let me know. And guys, please hit the like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next tutorial. Have a wonderful day.